I'm trying to stay cool for my audience. The few that are actually really watching. What the fuck? What the fuck is Miley Cyrus doing here? Welcome back everybody to chapter 6 of The Beast Inside. I haven't been able to play this game for several days right now, but now we are finally here, you and me, and we are going to suffer through this journey together. And I'm so pumped up for this upcoming chapter, because if you have followed the previous chapters, you know that things are getting really, really insane right now. So let's jump into it. Christ, I can't do it on my own. There's so much blood. Dear God, is this one of the guests? I don't know. Go get someone. They'll bleed to death. Press on the wound. I'll get help. The janitor is upstairs. Room 207. Where are you? Who is this? Easy. Don't try to get up. Good Lord. No one will ever talk me into a mountain trip again. There he is. Looks like that missing fellow. The detective showed guests his dagger type. Detective? You mean that nosy fuck Walter Gilman? Holy mother of God! I have to telegraph the sheriff. Oh my no. God! This man needs a doctor. Uh, I've seen wounds like this. It's only a matter of minutes. I'm sorry, son. What are we looking at? These voices. There's so many of them. Wait, wait. I, I think I've heard this conversation before. Those people, they said that a certain detective, Walter Gilman, looked for the judge. If he was interested in missing people from the area, he might know something about my father's disappearance as well. Maybe at the reception desk I can find out his room number. Okay, so... I'm a little bit confused, but wow. <laughs> what are we doing here? What part of the story is this? Let's open this shit up. We got anything exciting in here? What did we get? Matches? I could need a smoke right now. Yeah, we got some matches. I guess we're gonna need those later. It was the janitor who usually kept the reception keys in room 207. Oh, 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 are we going to room 207 now? Ha! Huh? What do we got here? It's him. Judge John Norton, father's former associate. Is that possible? I've just witnessed a crime from a decade ago. I'm getting lost. Memories and delusions all bleeding into one. So that was probably Norton that attacked us. He was like a fire demon or something. I, I'm really not sure. But he was after us and we were protected by the guy or the thing in mask. And... Oh my god, this story is so special. The missing judge. Someone has been looking for him. Walter Gilman. Okay, what, what is this? Biscuits are watching. B bis biscuits are watching? Did you hear that? Fuck, someone was running behind me. I think. I just need to explore all of these things first. But, but we're heading to room 207. We need to find a key. Oh! 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 Okay! Okay! All right. Why the fuck are you throwing bookshelves at me? Holy shit, this... Fuck! This environment is so creepy. It is so fucking creepy. Hello? Anyone in here? No, I guess not. I guess we should stick to the task and try... I'm not alone. No, you're not alone. You're in a haunted fucking house. Get the fuck away from there. Let's light up some candles. Make this place a little bit cozier. And then we're gonna follow this bad boy in here and see what he wants. 
Excuse me, sir, do you have the key? I I'm looking for room 207. Looks like a map here. Aha! So we are there at room 113. We need... Do we need to go to a top floor? Because all the numbers here on this floor are starting with 1. So I guess that 2 or 7 might be on the second floor. It seems pretty logic to me. But... F Ho ho ho! I just I, I we just need to follow him. We need to follow that guy, sir. Where are you going? Of course. He's showing us the way. He's showing up. I can't even speak anymore. But he's showing us the way up to the gates of hell, I guess. Wow! I love these paintings. What a nice portrait. I hope that was the noise from a bad stomach or someone's that's hungry. Nothing else, please. God, who is this? What is he doing here? Do oh, you really want to find out? I don't think it's a good idea. Sir? Sir? Where did you go? Did he go this way? Hello? We need to light up the candles. All the candles we can find. Now that bitch is whispering again. We are in hell right now. We are in hell. This is a... Uh, some kind of note, but we can't read it. Hello? Who's making those noises? Lock the door. Thank God. I'm actually glad when the doors are locked because I don't want to explore all, all the all the rooms. I'm too fucking scared already. Okay, so... 207. Are we here now? Is the room 207 right here? We came from the stairs. It should be here to the right. Maybe in here. Damn, there's a chain. Damn, there's a chain. Ay, 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 ay. So sharp. Maybe I could use it to cut through the chain. What are the odds? That you accidentally find a fucking saw in the other room. This is like sent from above. Is this one locked too? So we get, are we gonna try to find something to cut this up in order to get the saw and cut the rest of it? What are we doing with our lives? Aren't we still having the bolt cutter? Such a bad idea just throwing that away. Okie dokie, okie dokie. So we need to find another way. Let's go in here. Hello, ghosts. Don't you fucking jump scare me now. I got a mission to do. I'm trying to stay cool for my audience. The few that are actually- Really watching? What the fuck? What the fuck is Miley Cyrus doing here? What was that? Where did it try to drag me? To hell, maybe? What have I gotten into? Well, you were stupid enough just walking into this fucking house. I wonder what's Emma up to right now, by the way. <laughs> Maybe she's still in the shower. Fuck you! Either she's in the shower or she's painting the walls or not doing anything. What's this? Are we gonna flip it over? Yeah! Trash the fucking place! God damn it, I love that. But for what reason? I'm not really sure. Is it something we need here? Nah, it can't be. I can't see anything. 
All right, so... Wasn't... This the room where the saw was? Or? No? Hello? Anyone in here? A rolled up carpet. Could be a dead body inside, you never know for sure. At least not in this hellhole. Are we gonna move this shit or is it just locked? At least we can grab a bucket and throw I hear some kind of breathing. And I do not enjoy it. Let's light this bad boy up. We got anything here? No, just things we can throw away. Are we going out? This one is locked as well. Okie dokie, open up this bad boy. We got any hidden secrets in here? Nothing. Just an ugly face. And a beautiful statue. Fucking smash that shit through the window. That would be so nice. I'm sorry for being so aggressive. I'm just pumped up for this. I'm just so pumped up. Crucifix! Yes, please! I could have thrown that on Miley Cyrus that showed up from the floor. Can I do something here, maybe? No, just a pile of blood. Or pool of blood. Pi you don't say pile of blood, don't you? Me and my fucking English, man. I'm really sorry for that. Are we going back? Okay. You got some heavily breathing going on. That's good for you. I'm just gonna grab some lamp oil, light up the candles, and... Get the fuck out of here. And uh, the rest will be history. I'm not sure if I need to explore all the surfaces here, but I, I'm just opening up just to be sure. I probably need all the items I can get. So, uh, a bottle of booze. Fuck you! We got a letter here that we are not able to read. Wait a minute, wait a minute, I see a pattern here. Now I think I know why we were... ...tilting this fucking shelf. Are we supposed to go up here? Yes, we are going up here. To another floor. Oh, here it is! What the hell is this? Looks like... ...a slaughter. Good God. Something's wrong here. I'd better grab that tool and get out of here. Should have thought about that long time ago, Mr. Adam. Should have thought about that long time ago. Something is wrong here. A saw like this can be used to cut through all sorts of metal obstacles, such as chains or padlocks. I'll take that! In the janitor's room. Yes! Now we can do it. Do we got any more items we need to use? What the fuck is this? I don't know what you call these animals in English, but fuck you! Uh, 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 I'm just going to explore a little bit quick before uh, proceeding this journey. You never know where you can find any valuable things in this game. And I love fucking making a mess as well, so... Yeah. Okie dokie, let's get out of here. Gonna fucking saw that fucking chain. Back and forth, there we go. Hello? Is it okay if I enter room 207? Why do I want to go in there? I, I just saw the face of a demon in here. And still I want to go in. Can't be that important. Suit yourself, Adam. Hello? 
Hello? Anyone home? I'm I'm just gonna grab a key and then I'll be out here in no time. Don't you worry. Maybe we need to uh, use the oil lamp. Let's do it. Just for that spooky sense of feeling, okay. Can't have enough of oil lamps in this game. Open it up. Let's see if we find a dead body or something. No, nothing bad actually. Can we light up that one? Good God, thank you very much. What happened now? Moth. Light 30 candles, oh! And the demon voice is back. That's just great. I think we're gonna close the door. Like that. And now we're gonna Poor investigate soul. further. He spent most of his life here, and after death, he's still the inn's janitor. But now for eternity. And the guests, from what I can see, are sure to cause trouble. Oh, I didn't see you at first, bad boy. They've been laying here for a while, I guess. Okay, kerosene lamp is empty. We need to use this. Blub, 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 blub. And then we equip it again. Oh, look at this bad boy. You drank too much. You see, alcohol is bad for you. Oh! Oh, 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 I, I didn't mean to offend you like that. I mean, uh, alcohol is good in the right amounts. Fucking hell, dude. Can be used to access room 106 and the hallway leading to the second wing of the inn. All right. Ah, ah, ah. The fuck is going on in this fucking place? Jesus fucking Christ! And it's all your fault! Just so you know. I wish I could flip you over or something, but I can't. The janitor's notes. I feel sorry for that poor wretch. 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 He took so. He took to drinking to keep himself sane. I'm afraid I might end up like him if those ghosts don't leave me alone. So that's why you were drinking? Well, okay, no, no, no bad feelings anymore. I kind of feel you now, bro. I kind of feel you. I would have done the same thing. But I would probably use some heavy drugs instead. I mean, that's probably better for you in matters like this or situations like this. Can we do something up here? Jump from the balcony and our suffering, maybe. Let's do it. This looks exciting enough to give it a try. Open the window. Hello! Is there anyone in here? We need a key for this one. But I don't know what key. Is it a key we already have? A mysterious key? No, we, we, we can use it later on. Hello? These hallways are fucking terrible. But a hidden key! Who would have known? Key to wing A. The wing A. Oh! Fuck you! What the fuck was that? It's a ghost. You smoked too much pot, Adam. That's what you did. Fuck. Is it something that is... Something that is stalking us? Fucking shit. 
Can I do something here? No. Should I remove the boards? Maybe we should go back the same way. I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure. Okay, it was the key to this lovely room. Do not open. Okay. I'm going to open that door so bad. Jesus fucking Christ. Note with password. Looks like the janitor had a serious problem with one of his guests. What? So you, so you mean he like barricaded them in? So one of the bad guests are in there? <laughs> I do not want to explore that room anymore. I'm done with this shit. I'm done. So I guess we can push this one down. Yeah. Oh. Come on, big boy, you can do it. Push it down. Yeah! Let's fuck this place up. Oh, yeah! I'm like a fucking rock star. There we go. So we're going down to room... Was it 106? Somewhere down here in the hellhole? Kerosene lamp is empty. Well, fuck you then, kerosene lamp. What is going on in this fucking game? What the fuck is going on? We need to look at the map. <sighs> Room 106. Okay, it's on the other side of the reception. So we need to go back. Are there actually two rooms that are numbered the same? 106, 105, 103. Okay, we need to go to the other side. We need to go back here. It should be here. This should be it. Excuse moi? Any demons around here? I guess that's a yes. Oh, we need to light up the candles. Quick as possible. Come on. Light that one up, and then we have another bad boy over here. Light it up. Kerosene oil, thank you very much. I think we're gonna need that. Oh, we need to refill it. There we go. Okay, and so many things are locked. The doctor's business card. It looks like a business card of some doctor. Rotate to find hidden message. <laughs> Can we rotate? Oh boy. Soon before the accident at the mine, the relations between my father and his associate became very strained. George was irrit irritable. Irrita irritable because of the stagnation in their business and for some reason he seemed to blame everything on my father or me I might have been insufferable brat I can't deny that but he keep telling me keep calling me a lunatic and saw my innocent pastimes as deranged is it possible that he had brought a psychiatrist all the way here just to get rid of me or maybe it was about some other boy. Or maybe it was about some other boy. W was it me or not? I don't really know if I'm the only one, but I'm getting pretty confused by this story, I must say. It's pretty hard to catch up with everything, but... It's still interesting, of course, so I can give them that, but yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just so confused. Okay, so I, I don't think we can find anything more here. I guess. Kerosene oil. That's pretty much it. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with that? Of course, we had the ghost left as well. We needed to find the fucking ghost too. 
The stalking ghost. Okay, so what are we up to now? What are we doing? What are we gonna do in this hellhole? Open this drawer, maybe? <laughs> That's a good start. We have another note here that we can't read. Just to throw it away. God. I think I hear some flies, so maybe there's a dead body over here somewhere. It's never a good sign when you hear fucking flies and shit. There's something rottening nearby. Okay, let's just go on. I wanna... I wanna light more candles. Uh... Jesus Christ. So what are we up to now? Can we explore something in here? We haven't been here, haven't we? And it's locked, of course. What else? What else? Are you still with me, by the way? Good for you. Good for you. Oh, I'm just so creeped out and confused right now, so I, I, I barely know how to think. Okie dokie. I can hear the flies again. Nothing in there. Nothing we can do with that one. Oh, we gotta pick another lock! Long time ago. We could have done those with the other locks as well. Why am I looking for keys? Hello? Any ghosts in here? Light that one up. What's this? I heard footsteps again. What's this? Okay, let's look at this. A lump of pyrite from my father's mine. Some call it fool's gold, but it has brought considerable wealth to the Hyde and Whitehead families. Looks like a package of drugs, to be honest. Throw it away! That's right. You're not in charge anymore, Daddy. I'm the one who's in charge now. And I heard the demon again. Or the ghost. Whatever you want to call them. Something is going to pop up any minute from now. Make yourself ready, you guys. This is probably going to be awful. Can we squeeze our way through somehow? Or are we supposed to go in here? I guess that's a no. But I hear something. I still hear fucking creepy whispering, so there's gotta be something going on. Hello! Can I come in here? Anyone? No one? What do we got here? Do we got some more lamp oil? Yeah, boy! I'm gonna need that for sure. And an uh, old book that I can throw away. Do nothing with. Some forks and shit. Maybe I can pick the ghost in the eyes with this motherfucker. <laughs> Just <laughs> throwing things away. I, I I guess we're going back out. The kerosene lamp is empty, okay. Thanks for nothing then. What, what are we doing with this one? Oh, it was a... I didn't see what it was. It's kind of hard for me to see here in the darkness because I have the... The studio light towards me so I can't really see all the details
Can we move this bad boy <laughs> for no reason at all? <laughs> we can just flip things over. <laughs> I'm really making a mess in here. For no reason at all, but I still love it. Another locked window that we can do absolutely nothing with. It's stuck for good. That's no use. Huh? It's stuck for good? So... The gun is just stuck to the floor for some reason. So that means we can't defend ourselves. That's great. That's just great. What are we going to do with this bad boy? Are we going to try to open it up? Oh, we have a little code. Uh, but I haven't picked anything up yet, haven't I? I have no notes. So I think I have nothing in particular to go with. Okie dokie. Can we go upstairs? No? Not yet. Too soon. Guys, I must apologize so badly to you because something just happened in the middle of my gameplay. OBS stopped working because it wasn't enough disk space to be able to record anymore. So everything was just completely interrupted and it stopped recording. And I had like about almost an hour left to play and all of that footage just vanished away. And there was nothing I could do to get it back. So I'm afraid I have to say that if you want to look at the rest part of the chapter six, I'm afraid you have to uh, jump into another YouTube channel instead. I know, it really hurts to say, it really hurts to say. But I'm afraid you have to watch this at another YouTube channel instead. And then, when you've watched that, you come back to this channel right away, okay? You hear me? You come back to this fucking channel right away, and we continue with chapter 7 and all the other chapters together. You and me. Because we are a family. Isn't that right? Yeah, that's what I thought. So once again, there was nothing I could do to save this. You are not able to go back to the previous chapters in this game and play them from the beginning for some reason. It's pretty stupid, but unfortunately I just can't do that and there's no way I can save this. So once again, really sorry. Please come back for chapter seven and I see you in the next one.